Who's the team? It's... So we got Mason Ooh. versus Bigger Back. Are we on? Short time, baby. We are on. So have you played Bigger Back before? I have when he played Dalsum. Dude, Bags, Chun Li is disgusting. Yeah. He's been playing modern Chun for a while now. That's what I've heard. That's what I've heard. I've heard it's treacherous. Zone Dude, anymore. it's despicable. His... Okay, so do you know anything about Bag as a player? He's a keep out player. Yeah, he plays so Axel. He yeah. is one of the uh, I, I would put him as like top three maybe. He's very good at for Guilty Gear. Yeah. And as Axel and his Chun is no joke at all. Okay. I wouldn't be surprised if we see this Chun make it to top eight. Okay. And here we go, but Mason showing that like he's oh. no slouch, burning him out. Yeah, massive block string there. I never even see that. Oh, but Mason burns himself out and kind of loses that advantage he had. Yep. DJ, like, it's such a scary character when you're burnt out, but now Bag's kind of at an advantage here. Oh, man. Here. Baby, baby. Okay. Interesting how he's doing those on block. Exactly. It is punishable, but you can space and, that. And you can kind of see the way Bag is, like, playing for these two. That he's Ooh. a boy player. Oh, my God. Oh, no. Don't, don't let it happen this way. Nice parries nice. and the crouching medium kick. Nice. I haven't seen Mason plus before. Yes. And he chose a really good option there. Like, OD fireball is so good versus people who want to throw fireballs. Because you just yep. win that neutral war immediately. Yep. And, and you, you get, go like, what, 40%? If you win the zoning war with DJ, you're getting more damage than any other zoner, I think, right? Easily. Oh, JP, JP. Maybe JP gets a bit more, but I even think DJ's OD fireball probably got the best conversion. It's crazy. I I really hope people aren't downplaying DJ anymore. Oh, no. I think the DJ okay. downplay is gone. <laughs> that was okay. funny. Oh, but that's a conversion. Nice. We are wave two, so you might have to head out. Okay, that's okay. Keep it. Oh, but the jump, he can press that button a little bit earlier in the air. They're playing an interesting fireball heavy game right now. Yeah. Is his death? Wow, back to wow. the bar. He's and confident. He was confident. That's the thing, his back plays very calm and collective. Yeah, yeah, that's what I remember. I've only played him once in this game. Nice DP. Yep. Wow. That modern reaction. I would imagine this is one of the matchups that, like, Chun can't really fully her way in. But, you know, if you just throw everything out there. Oh. Okay. 
And this is kind of that situation where, like, the OD fireball is so like, Yeah. Uh, as soon as I say wow, that, Wow, okay, that. okay, okay. Confirming. Uh, this kills, right? Yeah, that kills. That's dead. If that doesn't kill... Yeah, oh, even with modern, even with I modern. Think they, I think he input the super there. Okay. Oh, yeah, that... I forget about that all the time. That it brings back the normal damage when you do the input. Exactly, so. and that's one of the big strengths of modern. And there is Mason. Dude, I love this fireball game. This yeah. is sick. And I think it's Mason. I think Mason is running down bags more than he needs to. Like, you can yeah, win this zoning game here. Just play it. Just take it. Put the onus on bag to go in. And as I say and that, again, yeah, when you get that punish counter uh, uh, drive impact of DJ, I mean, all the rush down and yeah. going in and being a menace is worth it. Nice block. Nice anti-air. An anti-air. Boxing him in. Nice blocking. Didn't take the bait. Yeah, and there we go. Back in. And that's what I mean. Like, playing a zoner in a game like Strive, it prepares you to walk in on people and block their buttons as you're going in. And yep. I think that's what makes Bag such a good chunk. Yep. That's, in theory, what we should be doing against zoners. Oh, yeah. But then we get impatient. And then we get hit. Okay. Oh, no. Clipped. Trying to walk back after hitting Crouching Medium Kick. Getting hit for it. Oh, nice Ooh. carry. But it was too deep. Wow, that's how good that That must have is. been a safe jump. Yep, yep. 100%. Double fireballs now. Oh! Hazan Chu. And you know that, and I think that might scare Mason away from playing the zone again. Yep. Oh, now DJ can't really do it as easily. Yeah. Oh, uh -oh. But Just as soon as he gets that advantage, he burns himself out. They're both at level three. Oh, my oh God. that's game. Okay, okay. Does yep. Super 2 go through fireballs? With DJ? With Chun, with Chun. Oh, with Chun, yes, yes. That was, uh, we saw it um, against, uh, it was Noah versus, um, how am I forgetting? Uh, I, I know their name and I can't remember it. Yeah, uh, Singularity, Singularity. Okay. Aki versus Chun. Here we go. <laughs> there is that damage. You would expect modern, but like there's half your health. Yep. <laughs> okay, throw. We're gonna loop. We don't have the bar to loop. We don't have the bar to loop. He's gotta kind of walk his way in. Yep. And now he's a little worried about these fireballs because, like, Bag only has to press one button to hop over him. Yep. Yeah, no, he can't be. Can't get too egregious. With well, the doubles. Yeah, the double fireball is so good against Chun. Whoa! Not at that range. And it's Ugh. good, but you know, Bag's a little better. Mm. He's a little bit bigger. Everybody makes that joke. It's a, it's a. Like, yeah, that I, sucked. I, that that was an ass. No, joke. no, don't worry. I've done it too. I've like, I, I've even said like when Bag loses, I'm like, I guess he was the smaller Bag. The you know, small, there's yeah. No, there's no way. It's hard to resist. Oh, okay. What a oh. shimmy. Oh. Oh, oh no! No! That's a huge drop. Dude. Bag just gonna take advantage here. Move in. Oh my gosh. Was that supposed to be just machine gun? I think that had to have been a combo yeah. and he just missed it. Man. Good parries though. Nice defense. Exactly. He's being patient. He's like, he's, he's going to stay stone cold in the face of that brutal exactly. drop. And that's kind of one thing you can really see in the set. I feel like Bag has been playing very patient. While Mason has been trying to force things and right there. Oh! Wait, what happened? It, was, it didn't go far enough. It didn't go far enough forward. Death. Dang. Dang. We didn't need it. Oh, that was a Truly. good game. That was a good game. Unfortunate drop, but the patience from Bigger Bag was nice. Yeah, that was it's, nice. It's not, it's not the worst. Bag is a great player, and you know, Mason, honestly, he was playing really well. Yep, yep. Uh, Ant. I might have to play soon. Maybe I should get on later. Uh, you can hop back on over later. Worst case, I'm here. I'll hold it down by myself. Okay. Um, if, you, if you do hop off, go find a... a Bros. It's about to play, too. Who, who played? Go find TC and tell him to come over here. Yeah, grab TC. Grab Kay. TC and tell him Green needs him on commentary. Okay. And if he doesn't come, I hate him. Okay, I'll, I'll tell him all of that. He owes me for knocking me out of bracket. <laughs> tell him that. Oh, he knocked you out? Yeah, TC. Oh, me. you got I, it's okay. I don't, I don't care because I, I killed him with just FC, FSC one game, Feng Shui Engine. Oh. I hit him with the overhead. I hit him with the empty load twice. I hit him with the safe jump. I hit him with the frame trap fake. That was all one round. All of your physics <laughs> oh, yeah. research. Every, every option I have, I hit him with. Okay. That's all I wanted to do in tourney today. I didn't care about winning. I was here to do one Feng Shui engine, <laughs> match and win. I just wish it was on stream. Yep, just the science. It's like scientists, you know, they 
Oh, yeah, man. They can mess up a million experiments, it's... but the one that's good makes them so satisfied they don't even I just want to look sick on screen. That's it. I just, well, want, I just want to look, and that next time, I'm going to look sick on screen. I'm all right. Excited. That's excited. what I want. Although the Marisa, I'm, I'm partial the, to. The Marisa's but... fun, but like, man, Feng Shui. crouching medium kick is like so nice. Yeah, true. I really like crouching medium kick. I'm, I'm going to keep playing Marissa. I hate Guile. I hate, uh, Fair enough. I hate anybody that can zone me with Jury except JP and Dalsim, but like, you Ryu, know, Ken, uh, Guile, I'm maybe even like, we'll see about Luke. I'll probably uh. play Marissa in those matchups. All right, we're oh, playing. Are you on stream? Okay, okay. okay, okay. All right, I'm go, probably go. not going to find TC. You'll see him. He's over there. Just tell him to come over here. Or if you see anybody else, tell him to come over here. Okay, boys, I'm going to hold it down on my own. Right now, we got Raven versus Ross. Now, earlier, I played the team tournament versus uh, Raven's team, and I made the joke that uh, his name is Raven is Raw, but it's actually Raven is Free. That was that was just commentary because I was biased against him. Raven is actually really good. He uh, reverse 3 0 our team in Losers, and we went and played him afterwards, but like that was first to one. And Frost, Frost is a pretty solid Cami player. But we'll see how this goes. I think Frost is really the one here that has to prove himself in this matchup. Uh, Raven, a uh, previous Ken, uh, not Ken, Ryu player, swapping over to uh, Luke. And I, you know, I think it was the right call. I might hop off for a brief second to go pull someone over to help me with commentary, so I'm not alone. Unless Mangaka wants to come. Mangaka! Oh, All right, let's get it. As long as you know, I'm only asking you because I love you. Anyways, let me go find somebody else. I'll be right back, ladies. Okay, I'm running it solo. We got this. I have been told by the commander in chief. You let me know, I got this. Okay, here we go. NCG Frost versus is Raw. And it's starting out, and I think the big thing in this matchup is Emmy really wants to use her. Oh, you know, here goes Frost going in pretty hard with being set. Oh, immediately turns it around. Okay. Raven getting up the corner back. And now he's just gonna he's just gonna play back. And there we go, the spin knuckle from Frost. Really taking him far right now in the set. It's been such a difference maker. And then, oh no, he went for the command throw, but he didn't do early. Maybe it was an input error. And with that, Raven is gonna take the set. And that just goes to show in Street Fighter, this is a game where like one small mistake can really just snowball into you losing. You go from like winning the match to being burnt out in the corner. And then they just do like what? One, two throws, you get shimmy, they hit you, they drive impact, you die. And then joining us on commentary, Silver Tabby grabbing the other headsets. Oh, Mean Tabby Green are here to commentate. Frost getting level three into the corner. Yep. And this is going to burn him out right here. It's a really I, rough no, situation. Going to have a flipper left. Oh, wow. Good but like read. blocking a heavy and that's done. I'm just saying, Sage We don't block, gotta, though. Sage has got to get the stream out. Will it burn out? Don't mm -hmm. need to burn out if you're down. Mm -hmm. As Raven takes the first round. And I think Frost playing a lot more like competently than. Uh, I, th I think he's rising up to meet the challenge. Just a few drops here and there, but I guess he's not super confident in the cami. He's like, you know what? I see your Luke. Let me show you mine. You're not throwing up fireballs for like the hooligan combination and the spin knuckle back to like work out here. Yeah, exactly. I mean, yeah. so look, he said he took him to Memphis and Frost was like, okay, here well, we go. We're in Memphis right now, Luke Mears. Welcome to the Memphis. Thing is like, ooh, the EX. Sandblast going through. I, I love this Sandblast war. Cross was looking a little bit weak at the start of it, but like with that perfect parry and the choice of the EX Sandblast, Cross is like looking strong right yeah, now. Man, took... I, this is a pretty even set so far. Both yeah. players burnt out. Wolf just kind of tossing fireballs. You know, I surprisingly haven't seen many loot mirrors. For how common the character and how strong and effective he is, you're right. Like, we should be seeing way more. I, I oh, agree. wake up DP gets baited. And I, you, you were burnt out, Cross. What were you doing there? Oh. He's not real. Okay. Okay. Is go. Luke 
someone who does low forward into Dry, oh, drive yeah, impact he, he rush, or is it drive rush into low forward? He actually has like the best low forward in the game, I think. Like Ooh. one of the best. Frost getting counter Super hit jerk. out of their EX fireball is going to put them in a really bad situation Ooh. in the corner. I Burnt. love the DI reset. Burnt out and stunned with the DI reset. Okay, okay, we're going to go for another reset. I we have a safe jump. There. That reversal, because it was blocked, was technically punishable, but it was spaced out so far. I don't think that Luke's has anything to make it work there. Might not have been ready with the burnout, too. Just yeah, it's pretty rare to nervous. actually see someone use the drive reversal. Okay. Frost oh, just like... Frost looked at his health and was like, you know what? Yeah, send it. Fits. Here I come. Just and send it all the way through exactly. as Frost... Oh, uh, it's as Frost uh, gets sit down to loser side on our round two of our second round of pools here at Akihabara Arcade. And Raven is someone to watch out for. I think he's a really good player. And I don't see his name talked about as much as it should be. I missed a turn here too, so it might be on me. It might be on me. You know the little Shaq meme where it's like, I'm sorry, I was not familiar with your game. That's how I felt earlier in Team Turning. It is. He's really good. He's a really solid Luke player. Oh, and yeah. I'm excited to see more of him. Like, it's wonderful to see just the sheer variety of characters that we got going on. Yeah. I say right out of a mirror match. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. I mean, it started It started Cammy versus Luke, okay? Frost <laughs> is a Cammy player, and I think the Cammy was going better for him overall, to be honest. I think he should have stayed on Cammy in that set. It was a few combo drops that really killed him. Like, maybe other than switch characters, just Flame out your combos a bit more. And right now, I see some people coming up. I don't know his tag, but I believe he is a Ken player. And I'm trying to see who's on the other side. What are the player names we got here? Gonzo two times and CG Roop. So CG Roop is a Manon. And I would say as a Manon, previous Manon player for about like two locals, uh, I think CG might be the best one on CG or uh, the Fort Collins based kickback who is not here. So obviously he's not one of the best because if he was good, he would be here. <laughs> uh, so I want to say CG Roop's the best one on in Colorado right now. Hey, if you don't show up, I get to, we get to claim the title. Yeah, if you don't, if you don't come here, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna say you're good. That's all I got to say. Unless you're at the Springs. If you're here in the Springs, I respect Ooh, you. <laughs> we have some Springs energy happening right I'm now. I'm just saying, Fort Collins, they're not really showing up. No, Brosif is here. Brosif is here. And he is Fort Collins. I think Ant is also here. and he's, I teamed up with Fort Collins. I'm trashing them here, but my team was pure Fort Collins. Oh, here we go. CG Roof versus, what was his name? Gonzo. Uh, Gonzo two times Gonzo on the player two, two side. Times. Is that an Akira shirt, or I can't, I can't really tell. Can you see? Let's see if I can get it any bigger. I think that is totally an Akira. It, it looks like Akira to me, but the other characters don't. There's like a castle on the bottom right going on. You know, that's a Ken player. You see him like taking his hands together and like getting shifty eyed about it, like planning. Okay, here we go. CG Roop versus Gonzo two times. I'm excited to see CG's Manon. Yeah. Uh, so Manon like a lot play of against like a uh, uh, Manon play against uh, these uh, Shoto's uh, Fireball Day Zoners creates these really interesting matchups. And Manon actually has like decent answers for it. Once she gets in the corner, that's where she Ooh. kind of throws out. But CG, One proving he's ready to get out of this corner. I like that attempt on the sweep. Okay. And I also like how the Manon immediately, like CG, yep. immediately went for the jab and to reset for the throw, building exactly. up the metals as quickly as possible, taking the hard risk for it. I think it's what you got to do. And Again. Right here he's testing them out. Can Three. You, are you going to get hit by every driver at command throw? We'll Three see. medals out of five already. Punishable, but okay. spaced out. He's not dead yet, and CG is, is burnt out. Four medals. If you lose this round in the middle of my sentence, this oh, is going to yeah. be a really uphill battle for Gonzo. But right here, CG, it's going to be rough. Ooh, French trap, okay. See what he does with this corner. Okay. Extremely I like respectful. Yeah. Last round we saw CG Roof like aggressively leaving the corner. This time, just like, I'm going to block. Exactly. I don't think you got anything. Block, block, block. And there's CG just playing safe. Another command throw doesn't care. Doesn't care. I'm Look just gonna that do it. I know I know you're gonna get hit by every drive rush command throw. I'm just gonna do it and yeah. watch your health go down and then play safe. And that's a good Manon strategy. 
And with that, uh, CG taking the first game. What I want to see here is like CG's going for a lot of these overheads. I want to maybe see a little bit more PI from uh, Gonzo to kind of check the overhead. Also, I think Manon is just kind of character you have to DI once or twice to show that you're going to do it. A lot of Manon's uh, options are just like one or two simple hits. As there we over the commentator go. headset too. See right as I'm talking about wanting to see more DIs, right there, he does it, checks that overhead, and gets him. And now it's CG Roop's turn. Gonna get the command throw. Taking the round, getting a stack. I'm here. I have everything planned for Dragon Ball. We're gonna have Savantrex jump in to run stream after his set stream match. Bong Water is gonna help out with the Dragon Ball stream, so. I got, I got people in places, and CG Roop has command throws on Gonzo's hand. And this whole set, like, all CG has been doing is been doing, like, button, drive rush, and command throw, and Gonzo has not held up once. So, like, if you're playing Manon and you've noticed that, I mean, nice. we're just gonna throw you. DI, but CG Roop shows a safe poke, able to block in time. Plus frames. What a oh. mash! The overhead! And now we escape the burnout situation. Gonzo back to the wall. Okay, I think he's gonna walk in, press a button, DI super. That, I mean, not DSU, but DI command. Not drive rush command. Drive rush, can't say it. Oh, but there's the sweep, the special Never sweep. Mind. He had footsies. I was wrong. He had legsies, you kidding me? Like, like, like she just went full spread eagle, just like, yo. I, I, I've definitely, I've been picking up Jury recently, and I keep sweeping, thinking I have Manon sweep, and it doesn't go nearly as far, and no, I'm no. just whiffing in front of my opponent. I know, right? And you know, there you are going, man, I should have pressed crouch medium kick. Yeah, I mean, What, oh, what yeah. am I doing? I, what look, am I as doing? as a Manon player, I'm not, I'm not used to having that <laughs> Privilege. Yeah, the privilege is so nice, but when you're not ready for it, like, mm. You really gotta learn to abuse your privilege. True, right? Learning this type of character. I mean, you know, like, listen, like, there, there's all kinds of privilege everywhere, right? There's Caucasian privilege right here. There's there's e-girl privilege, right? That's what Jury's doing with the feet picks. You know she's making a oh, fortune yeah. oh, selling yeah. those. That's the privilege. I can't I can't monetize like that. But in return, I also don't have to worry about being, you know, like a baby being followed down dark corridors in an alleyway at night. I mean, look. She likes to beat people up, so maybe she's into that, you know? No, she, she's a total sadist. Alleyway. She's a total sadist. She's the one jumping me. You're following her, and then suddenly your foot. <laughs> 2 MK, there it is. 2 MK, crotch That's me, did you? Kick right all there. of a sudden, Not she's ready. green all over the screen, yep, just like, over. oh, God. She screams, Feng Shui engine's activated, safe jumps incoming. Mm -hmm. Eat this 33. Oh. Oh. Oh, wow. There you go. Yeah, sorry. I didn't mean to just... <laughs> hey, you like your mag grab like that? Oh, is this, this is good. This is good. Good, good. Little, you know, just like, I, I just noticed it's girthy. I was ready for. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's a girthy, hefty microphone. Thank, thank you. Is, tell me, is that, you know, before it? Anyways. <laughs> <laughs> so, <laughs> I always laugh here because, like, we, we talk about stuff like that. It's just our couch that we have for commentary. Well, I mean, it's the it's casting just, couch. It's the casting couch. It's the casting couch. Okay. I mean, it's a black casting couch. I mean, it's just like, I'm sorry, like in another, in another room. <laughs> so I got some information. It's on the back of the stage. It's not the back room. It's, it's the back the of the back, stage. In the back corner. <laughs> <laughs> anyway. <laughs> so I got some information for you here. Okay, hit me with it. Hit me with it. Savannah Tricks has not touched this game since Evo. According to himself, that's his words. Like, I haven't touched my stick since Evo. I'm just here, you know, I'm gonna I'm gonna chill, I'm gonna play some matches. And I'm, with that information, right, right. let's see we'll, how we'll this see goes. We'll see how he plays. You know the other crazy thing he told me is like, yo, I know no one says it, but ever, we really do appreciate you running these streams and getting these mods oh, yeah. and everything. He's like, bro, I got scouted at Evo because of you. Oh, wow. <laughs> Man looked him up and was like, yo, I got his game footage right here. I, I knew he was going to be a problem. He knew. He knew. He <laughs> I'm knew like, that you're that's godlike. I am actually sabotaging that my That is team. hilarious. So funny. But yo, he's cooking with his Kimberly. They there trade, but honestly, working out for YB, stuck in this corner, drive rush, burn out. And Savantrix is one of those players, like, he does not play often, but he is not a bad player. If he no. played this game, instead of playing Path of Exile for the 700th oh. hour, every game would look like this. Right? We have to see. He doesn't lose a beat. He's a multi-game talent. He's played almost any new game that's come out when it has. Yep. Solid Guilty Gear Strive player when that was a hard thing. Melty Blood's been one of the things where yeah. he's been, like, consistently getting within the top eight, sometimes top four. Yeah. Of our scene out here, and we got some really strong players. You look That's at Bitfish, Dazzy, Moose. Exactly. There's a lot of strong players out here in Colorado. 
definitely cannot sleep on it. And I'm curious to see how YB is going to handle this fury pressure. No, he tries to go for a shimmy, but I like that YB challenge with the button there, not going for the throw check. He's like, listen, I'm not taking throws, I'm mashing throws. Exactly. I feel like we have been in this corner the entire time. Oh, oh! Drop! But YB throws him out of the corner, gets the shimmy, though. Yeah. I, I know there's a Chicago punish, but is there a name for it when you throw them out of the corner, too? Is that a Detroit? Detroit? <laughs> I don't know, because we're trying to take this trip to oh, Memphis. Oh, there we go. Ah, okay. And he didn't drop the punish. He landed the punish successfully, and that was game one. Nothing else of concern yep, to address. Nothing else happened. I really want to see if... <laughs> Stand uh, there like Zoro. I, nothing happened. I'm curious happened. to see if Savantrix finishes any of his extended combos. True. I think he's dropped every single one so far, so mm -hmm. I'm curious. Again, bit of that, like, little rust, right? Hasn't exactly. touched this game since Evo, so it's like, oh, how do I do Ooh. this again? Because, you know, it's all muscle memory. That's what you have to practice to get to a sufficient level for fighting game play is to, in order to think about what your opponent's doing in the situations, the combos, the pressure, it's exactly. all got to be muscle memory. And there's one thing you can definitely see the muscle memory here is, like, Savantrix knows how to play footsies. He knows how to play this game. He might not be able to finish all of his combos, but... Ooh. The macro knowledge is there. He goes for a little yep. throw reset, gets a counter hit, baits the lightning uppercut. Ooh. It was a, not an OD uppercut from YB. No. Just tossing him out there. Those are not real anyway, shape or form. No. Even if it wasn't OD, DP though, would have been oh, the yeah, same fate. Oh yeah, would have gotten red in But yeah, like if there was a strike there, there's a possibility Savantrix Meaty would have just outright won, so... All right, this, these trades are honestly working out for Savantrix. Has the yeah. life lead, so you're content with like letting these jump-ins happen and letting your Ooh. normals do the work for you. Man, what a button. Did you see the crouching heavy punch just hit that like so far away? No jab confirmed for YB, but we still got some pressure here. Now we have the life lead in Luke's corner. Mash is oh, on the overhead. Mash. That was but again, these jab confirms. YB is letting a lot of damage go off of the table because they're not completing their crouching medium exactly. push confirms. Crouching life And punch. I haven't seen YB before. Maybe nice. it's a little bit of stream nerds not played on bracket. I'm like, I, I will say, I kind of like X said, you're going to play on stream, and there was not a look of happiness in those eyes. Okay. Oh, but we're happy right now. And, and you know, all it takes is one round. One round to make you more confident. All right, we're able to clutch that one out. Because again, YB's doing really well. It's just namely just those jab confirms. Yeah. Or even the jump and stuff. Like, right where's like, the special? Jab, 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 no special. I mean, a lot of jabbing. I guess you have the life lead. It's working. Mm -hmm. But it could be working better. True, right? You have the throw. Chuck him. Okay. Catch him here. Oh, speaking of jabs. Savantrix like here. I'll, I'll drop the combo too. Ooh. Oh, a beautiful DI reaction from YB. He's going to get the punish on Savantrix. How big's the combo? It's a perfect knuckle. There we go. Jump in. Those trades are not good anymore with this low of health. Nice tech there by Savantrex, aware of the option. You gotta be careful though, your drive meter is so low here on YB. Anything here could maybe burn him out. Nice anti air there from YB. Crouch fierce, dealing with it, and there you go. You got a game on stream. Yeah, and I think that's what you need to get that confidence. No, YB looking a lot more comfortable here, despite like the drop jab confirms. Yeah. Again, the anti air is consistent. The choices on defense have been fundamentally sound. Oh there my god. Go. But again, where's the special finisher? There's the DI. That's I, what I we need. I think playing well. He's just not really getting these extensions, like you're saying. And that's just something that takes time. Like, on stream, the first time you play on stream, it's always well. And Savantrix kind of trying to, like... But the thing is, like, YB's hitting the neutral and he's hitting the buttons. And I think Savantrix is seeing these drop combos and being like, oh, I don't need to... I don't need to take you as seriously as I think I do. And he's just getting hit for it. No. Situation goes out for Savantrix, baits the reversal level one. I respect it from YB, but sometimes you gotta hold. Yep, I respect it. DI could be there. True, you right? Yeah. Fight for your life. Yeah, right? Like, there's a timeline where Savantrix went from meaty DI and YB's level one super look genius. Yeah, exactly. So, again, just being proactive. I like these choices from YB. They're not just sitting there holding it down, they're trying to make the read. And sometimes you gotta be wrong, but hey, at least you went down on your terms. Yeah. YB might be missing some of these extensions, but he's definitely playing Street Fighter. Yes. And that's what really makes a difference. Okay, they're trading. YB's in the corner. Get some yeah. offense here at the drive rush. That pressure ends in the fireball. Oh. Trey will go Spandrick's way. Counter hit. Okay, Full so extension. Situation. Is this? Oh, I think that could have been killed with the EX Command throwing to Super. Yeah. Possibly. Just I think Spandrix dropping the combo. Yep. Fades back, and I like that YB oh. jump back. Oh, finish him. That's gotta be it. That's it, right? You don't play with your food this much. Ah! Oh! We play with our food! We get DI'd! We get stunned! No, like but no, no jump in. Super! We keep it simple! We, we keep, keep it simple. simple. Beast mode! Yeah, wrong super. Someone's corrected him.
All right, but again, this wasn't a jump hit punish. A lot of damage left on the table for YB. Savantrix, the tick throw doesn't work. Bro. And there's the trade. Savantrix will take it, but... All, all I heard is that in the commentary was beast mode. My brain couldn't stop. So we're, we're like, repeat it. I was beast like, mode. beast mode? Beast, beast mode? Let's beast go. mode? No, Yo, beast mode, baby! And honestly, if I if I was him, I would have just raw DI'd. After that, After that? I was like, oh, you just messed up like that? You're not ready. You're, you're thinking about how mad you are for your drop. I'm just going to DI. Savantrix, don't... You, you hear him? He's like, no, I haven't no, played no. for two months. He's already making the... Yeah, right. Savantrix! He's getting roasted right now. Up on stage live. He deserves it. Must Beautiful. stay sitting here making fun of him. Yeah, the answer. Oh, it's so fucking funny. Well, my friends, Listen, man. I got a Dragon Ball Top 4 to run. So I'm going to be bouncing from the nice. couch. Good luck with Dragon Ball. Appreciate that. Make Hold it, it down for me over I here. Have Savantrix come over here so I can make fun of him for like uh, all of his. Oh. He'll listen. He'll listen to you. He'll listen to you there. Oh man. So if you guys ever want to see what Path of Exile does to somebody, you can just look at Savantrix's gameplay. You start playing that game, and you start playing other, stop playing things, and then you show up at locals, and you play like that. You drop those combos. You get hit by DI. Super, not one command throw in the air combo hit the entire time. He missed every air grab extension he went for. <laughs> okay, and we're switching on over on the Steam setup, not Steam setup, stream setup right now. Uh, I think the person running is switching out. Symmetrix is taking over. He might not be playing Street Fighter, but he will be running stream. We just need to find our matches.
Street Fighter 6 Uh, survivalist, heroic as a tiger is. Earn my face, cause you know I'm do or die with this. Journey started young, super hard headed. Call me crazy, but you is not my psychiatrist. Through a lifetime of strife and struggling. Be the best, that's my covenant. And I'm a I think it was the, I think it was the year with the COVID. Because I got it online. Okay, this is the COVID trick. Yeah. I, I like the COVID one. I did not really like the last one. I think we're on. Yeah, we're on. So we're gonna have Rise versus Veach. Um, uh, I don't think I've ever seen this matchup a whole lot, actually. So I think Chun actually plays this matchup pretty well, um, just because she can walk in and out of that button. But I mean, she still has to deal with the corner pressure, same as oh, the yeah. rest of us. Yeah. So okay. I don't know if Veach played that way when you guys played him, but Veach is a really aggressive Ken. He likes to choose. These Kunai right. Unga options. Throw. Ooh. We do wake up lightning kick. Would have blown up the throw. I respect the option from Ryze, but it didn't work out. But yeah. I don't know. Getting hit while burnt out like this is oh. always. Oh. Side switch. Okay. Is that the same jump? Yeah. Overhead. Okay. One DI and that's it. Yeah, you got one shot. But you have no health. Oh. oh. So do you know Ryze at all? No, I actually so don't. So Rise is the is he's our resident Potemkin player. Oh, uh, okay. So he is a grappler main, so he's used to playing kind of like this footsies oriented yeah. game, patience. But I think Chun really suits him. Nice. Yeah, right there, what a shimmy. Nice. Put the in the corner. There we go. Throw. Doesn't get throw. Another shimmy. Oh, nice. good check nice. on the. Yep. Oh, don't you? Nice reset. You're burnt out now. It's scary, but nice. avoids the DI. Just trying to throw fireballs, maybe avoid the uh, dry rush DI. Mm -hmm. Jin right. Okay. Nice fireball. You see what I mean? Chun Action. like kind of creates a wall that's hard for Ken to penetrate. Oh yeah. Nice carry. Okay. Okay. Ooh. Into level three. 
Are we gonna see a... Are we gonna see what happened last round? Just on the other side this time? Yeah, I, I mean, the damage. Yeah. And, and you know he just wants to be eye. Yep. Yep. Not dead here. You got one more guess. Uh-huh. And he went for lightning kicks again. Oh! And Rise clinches out the game. Didn't have enough health. Uh, and this is winner's top 16 qualifiers. So this is yeah. first to two. Mm -hmm. There we go. Take a burn. Reset. There we go. Good driver. Oh, man. You got to be careful with those dragon lashes because, like, you get a little too greedy with them. Still get blown up. Handshake. Okay. Cross the move. Cross up again. Ooh, and I got to say, Ryze has not been showing a lot of anti airs this game, so I'm yeah. wondering if Beach is going to pick up on that. Looks like kind of like he might be. Yep. Ooh, I. That is a worrying. Sometimes you got to do it, man. I'm a firm believer that sometimes you got to let it rip, you know, to show that you're going to do it. Sometimes you go to losers. <laughs> <laughs> you got to go, you know? Yeah. He's been getting hit by that over a lot. I think I would like to be able to see him be ready for it. I could see it being maybe Beach isn't ready for Rise to be the type of player he is. Back throw into the corner. Handshake. Oh! Nice no vertical shimmy. Nice pressure. Ooh. And there we go. Good job. On the counter, DI. Okay. Yo, man. Set up. Nice pressure, nice pressure. I respect just holding it. Okay. Nice throw attack. The meter drive meter on Rise's side is so low, but so is Beach's. Yep. Scary, but he's gonna super, you know. This is a horrible situation. Oh yeah, he's burnt out. He's about to be in the corner. But if you rise here, like maybe I lose this round. But I have three bars. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. Man. I think Beach has been going for so many like patient walk back kind of shimmies. And yeah. Rise has just been doing wake up button, wake, wake up, up air kick. yeah, air legs. Nice, the plus frame, more plus frame. What are you doing? Okay. Nice, okay. there we go. Right. And I think that's really been like the big decider is just Ryze holding this like mid screen, but here's Beach with an opportunity. Oh, and that was definitely legs. Yeah. Out of the corner though. Ooh, get Ooh the get shimmy. The oh, but there was another drop. It's only fair. Yeah. It's only fair. Throw. Fireball. Nice, parry into the low check. You're not dead here. Yeah. It's a scary situation, and another Dragon Lash. Dragon I really need to see a DI in one of these Dragon Lashes. Oh, but you know, I think poor Perry works better. But especially with the side switch, right? Mm -hmm. oh, that could have been it. Yep. Oh. I don't know about Drive Rush DI. Yeah. I don't know if that's it, Chief. You didn't even have the health, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. There we go. Parry. Maybe an attempt from a perfect parry from Rise. Yeah, that could have been it. Oh! Uh, too far to, to get the combo. Off the counter hit. Fading fireballs, jump in. Okay, we're gonna have corner pretty soon here from Rise. Nice oh, counter. but no punish. Another cross up. I like, there has not been many anti airs in this set. But it hasn't mattered. Reset. Don't get Dragon Lash, please. That's all I'm asking. Don't let Dragon Lash happen. And it happened again. <laughs> Jin right in the corner. I don't let you know if he loses, it's because of that one Dragon Lash. Oh, uh, yeah. So, we went for the vertical shimmy. Okay, the patience for both out. of these players. Oh, my God, that whip. That could have been it. There we go. Yep. It's seeing somebody with like uh, crouching forward from me in front of just in front of your face and pressing nothing. Yeah. It's maybe one of the worst feelings in this game. For sure. Okay, pressure. Okay. Great perfect parry. There we go. Are you gonna do a safe jump? Yep. Nice bunny counter. Confirm into the reset. I'm surprised we saw no super there from Rise. Like his drive meter is so low. Oh, yeah. I would have expected it just to kind of like regenerate resources. Right? Yeah, yeah, oh my god! Well, I think we're going to see a super now. Side switch. No. I guess he's going for kill. Okay. I want it. You got to spend something here. Rise. Rise. Rise, you don't need super. Oh, my God. Rise, if you lose this set, the 
because you just didn't want a super. He had no bar. I'm hoping you're playing for round three. What are you doing? Okay. Okay, we're playing for round three, right? Hopefully. <laughs> you gotta make it close, right? Rise is a hero here. I feel like Beach is a villain. <laughs> he should not be winning this round, but here we are. He's been, what, 100% on all those uh, Sivancho overheads? And yep. of course, he, he blocks it. Nice, corner carry. Nice. Okay, just getting hit out there. It's so close. Okay, uh, please super. Please super. I don't think he can. No. That. Nice back throw. Push him in the corner. Put him in the corner, you've got a chance. Nice. Okay, good check. check. Hit him with the handshake, kick my hand. Out of That's the it, air. game. Oh, we drop it, we reset you. We don't need to do combos here. It was only a matter of time before that one hit. You're not holding, you're holding down back. You're not holding back. Yep. He was what, probably 9 for 10 on those? Yeah, I want to say Ryze won like, should have won that set like five interactions ago. <laughs> but, you know, and that's the thing is I just want to, I want to talk, I wouldn't want to say this until it's done. So I was at the Springs, like I want to say maybe not, the, the Springs local before uh, Aki Zeme, right? Okay. And uh, Beach is there. I think Gonzo two times is with him. Okay. And they're just chatting and they're talking and they're like, man, I really don't think these Guilty Gear Strive players are that good. <laughs> oh. I really feel like we could pick that game up and just win. And here he is getting bodied, losing, sent to losers <laughs> by the resident Potemkin. As an ex Strive player, I just gotta say. Okay. I do not play the Strive, but you know, Potemkin is not a character that you can easily win with, no, right? No. No matter how easy Snake Eyes makes it look. I'm just saying, sometimes he's asking for the L. <laughs> and he was asking it for right there, and he got it today. Yeah. So I, I'm just saying, Ryze had to defend our honor as Strive players. I respect it. Uh, I am actually a Killer Instinct player, so that's how I started. That's oh, so you're coming from KI. Yeah, 10 years old game, you know what I mean? I, you know, Strive's already t almost two years old. It's barely, is it, when does it stop being new? That's a good question. When they we're stop like updating what? it. We're in like season three. Yeah, when they stop updating it, that's then when you know. it's not new? Okay. Yeah, for sure. As that's somebody who, who came from a 10-year-old game, that's how you know. That's how you know. No yep. updates stop rolling out. Yep, no characters, no updates. But it's nice to have you here in street. How are you feeling like the Killer Instinct to Street Fighter pipeline goes? Because I think those games are like, I played a little bit of KI, not a lot, not okay. competitively, but enough to think that the game is maybe, I think there's a bit of a translation there. I think the way neutral is played is yeah. kind of similar. Like you fought Glacius, yeah. you're ready for JP. Yeah, uh, I agree. I think there is some stuff that like works and translates well, you know, depending on the characters you do. I play Spinal, kind of why I got the shirt on. He can kind of skip neutral, but you know, there are, I still I got an anti-air, I still got to do all these things. And that carries in every game, right? Yeah, you exactly. anti-air, you're, you're going to get jumped in the on. The raw fundamentals of the game are just so important to take you far. Sure. And right now, we are about to see the king of fundamentals. I, I would say he's the Colorado king of fundamentals. Maybe, okay. uh, it's either 72B or Shogun. I don't know who's the more fundamentally sound, but they're both like very fundamentally strong players. Okay. And then we have Yinja. Yinja is a great player as well. Yeah. Yinja is the Yolo King though. <laughs> and this has obviously always been a hard matchup for Ken, right? Like yep. the dawn of time 30 years ago when these two were throwing fireballs. It's never been a free matchup. Yep. I do think Ken kind of, like the way Ken kind of moves you so far forward after one hit, Kind of equalizes it about a bit in this game. Oh, for sure. But, I mean, Guile's good here. And I really like the patience here from Ninja. Ooh. Good, even better, Barry. Throw him into the corner. What's for breakfast? Okay. Strike. Boom. That was a great check. Side switch with Dragon Lash. But you're burnt out here versus Guile, so, like, I wouldn't. Oh! That'd be a fireball, maybe? Yeah. Walk and if I'm fireball. Ninja here, honestly, I'm just going to block. Or jump, <laughs> or, or jump forward, jump back, jump forward, jump back. Hit him with the rainbow, right? <laughs> Hit him with the rainbow. And there you go. And like he he survived that burnout. That's yeah. really what mattered right there. For sure. That's usually a death sentence against Guile, right? JP and Guile. Exactly. And the thing is, if you're a fundamentally sound player, Ninja is your worst nightmare because he does not care at all. Did you see that dash, jab, 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 standing yep. like kick? He's like, oh, you think you can check my jab? No, you're too slow. Plays with his heart is what you're saying, right? Oh, man. 
Nice. But... He plays with his heart and very little of the brain. It's there, though. That's the thing. Ginja tricks you into thinking he has no brain. It's there. He's aware. He's just nice. the hardest heart player to ever exist. Okay, good conversion from corner. 72. Set up with the uh, Sonic Blade. Four throw from Ken. I would like to see more of an aggressive Guile. From, you, like, you see your Burnt Out and the type of gameplay we're seeing here on Burnout versus Guile. I thought he was going to super. Oh, he did. I, it, honestly, and he dropped it again. It didn't matter. If I, oh my god! The Ken special. You know you have to be so tilted. Yeah. The Ken special is, they don't even confirm that. They just be throwing it out. I bet you Yinja just the, uh, oh no. No, it's not gonna work. Doesn't matter, yeah. Game one, Yinja. And I'm just saying, look, Yinja's a Dragon Ball player, but we claim him, we claim him as a main. Okay. I'm here to hype up every Stripe player that comes on. Hey, anime fighters, I get it. You see all that anime neutral going on? Yeah. <laughs> I mean, K.I. K is an uh, American anime, you know what I yeah, mean? Yeah, exactly. Just like Marvel. American anime is a good way of putting it. Okay, this is kind of what oh, I want to see. More of a him. fundamental game sure. from B. Surprised he let him jump in. Sonic Blade, Sonic Boom. Chipping away at that. Good, perfect game. parries. Yep, perfect. Ooh. And this is like the worst place to be for Sky. Oh, yeah. You're you're done. This is unless you make a godlike read. And that, okay, I want to say that overhead was the most cracked yeah, thing. Man. Just the balls to go for it. Yeah. Okay. Drive rushes in behind the crafting medium kick into a full combo side switch. I'm always wondering, is like the person like with punishing me with their drive rush, or are they just yoloing it? You never know. Yolo. I always assume it's Yolo, yeah. yeah. If it hit me, it was Yolo. Oh, yeah. Nice. Now, if I did it, Calculate. footsies. Yep. There we go, parry, parry. Okay. Working on those parry. perfect parries. Ooh. That was a good challenge. Oh. Gotta be careful against Kyle. Okay, and he's just gonna chip him here. Oh, the rare drop. Oh, Back throw, scrambling a little, but you're dead. I mean, I probably would have gotten hit. I think I would have just done a meeting. I respect you just willingness just to do it. Yeah, that was the game, right? Yeah. Oh my God, that didn't. That could have comboed, right? Yes. OD fireball. Yeah, I've never seen that not combo actually. I think he might have been too close. Oh my God, the six H, six heavy punch. Sorry. That's how you know I'm strive. I start throwing out numbers. Zooming out of the corner. Ooh. He has tried to check him twice with that now, and each time. Been ready. Now you hear full screen. You don't have much bar. Oh my god! Who cares about bar? Not me. We'll have a fireball war. I'll jump in. I'll sweep. I'll do another sweep. Two of K. Two of K. We throw everything. Now just chill. Just chill. You just need to chill. He's not. He's a camp player. You know. Oh, you know he's not. He's waiting for like him to breathe, and he's gonna do like command run overhead. No. Oh. Restraint. Yeah. Surprised he got hit there, right? I mean, walk him down, boom him down. There we go. Check that with the boom. We've all lost to Yinja online before. The online Ken, <laughs> you've seen, you've lost this. The flowchart online Ken. Yeah. You're not ready. Is, is he even flowcharting those <laughs> command run overhead? Yeah. Oh, he has been so on point with that. All of them have hit. Great combo, put him in the corner. This is a rough situation. I think you, you just take your L here. Yeah. Like, we're playing for the next round. I don't even think B needed us to the bar. Yeah, I don't think so either. And, uh, you know, if I'm Yinja and I saw that, all right, he's put the bar. You know what I mean? I got the... Yeah, he drops it again. Yep. Maybe it's because he's being heavy punch that close. Maybe you have to go for, like, a quicker normal. Yeah. I think he doesn't care if it combos or not. He's just going for the pressure. Oh, yeah. Ooh. Ooh. We parry those. Third yep. strike. Pushing him to the corner. Oh my god. Switch. What an right. insane and like great count. Great punish. Yep. The willingness to jump in. On a guile. If he can just confirm one of these hits into a level three, a like he is game. absolutely still in this game. Ooh. You can't gin right. Oh my god. And Guile's burnt out. He's, he's just gonna spend it. Don't 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 do anything. Be safe. Be safe. Let the bar go out. Yeah, you got it. Throwing a fireball. 
You have all the bar again. I thought DI was coming. I thought it was coming after the heavy punch. You should have. That would have been game. And there we go. Yinja almost taking it. It was yeah. a pretty respectable match. Yeah. Like, you want to call Yinja a flowchart camp, and that's how you lose to him. <laughs> he's he, he's good enough to break his flowchart when okay. he needs to. And, like, that's how he wins. That's how Ken plays yeah. after Born, right? Exactly. He's willing to not DP every time, really? just most of the time. Are you up? Your winner, winner side? Nice. I got to get taken out by TC. TC and Slug. I did the cool Feng Shui engine stuff. I'm happy. That's all I wanted today. Okay, boys. I'm gonna I'm gonna just eye people and shake my headphones again. Thank you. Okay, let's see who we can get. We're gonna go fishing. Okay, okay. Who do we got out there? Okay, I think we got Raven versus CG. Savantrix, you coming on? Okay, okay. I think it's Savantrix and me. I'm making eye contact with Volteon though. eye contact he walks away doesn't shake his head doesn't look at me just look straight past me maybe maybe if I look at ninja let me know if you're on Lee I can just hop over here We have Raven and Raw versus CG Roop. Yeah, Raven is Robert. I can't hear you. Can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you. Okay, okay. I can hear you a little bit, actually. Speak again. Okay, yeah. I just, I didn't there you go. Yeah, sorry. I needed to move the mic closer. Sorry. Okay. It sounded like you are a little far away. That was the yeah. only reason I did. Yeah, sorry. We're a bit short staff right now, but uh, we're making it work. Yeah, they're making it through. The TO's here. Props to them running everything. If it wasn't for them, like, this event wouldn't be run. There's like, I think 70 to 80-ish players right now in Street Fighter, and they're just getting through these pools. And I think this is our, another top 16 qualifier. Yep, this is the winner side of it. Yep, oh, winner of this gets the top 16. So it's gonna be uh, CG Roop versus Raven is Raw, and I think CG, according to Dire Straits, he is the best Manon in Colorado. Oh, yeah, he I'll said that to my face while I was playing Manon. I was talking to Veach earlier, and he said he was playing CG in casuals, and apparently CG was whooping Veach's butt. I believe it. Like, watch how CG plays neutral in this match. He's very patient, and he does a lot to, like, read your habits. But Raven is really good here. Raven is actually, I think he's one of the hidden warriors. If there's anybody going to make a big showing today that pop out that people don't know about as much, it's going to be Raven. Yeah. I mean, Raven's been doing pretty well. He uh, was one of the yeah. last chance qualifiers at Akizemi. He took his team to uh, second place in the uh, team tourney today. Yeah. And it's uh, it's good to see the loop representation you know, early on. In the oh, game. wait. No, no, no. He got fourth. We beat him. Never mind. <laughs> okay. Raven is free. I got to remember. Oh, my God. Right as I say Raven is free, here it comes. He's a good player, though. This Raven. is a scary situation versus Manon. Burnt out, but kind of neutral. Yep. Oh my god, but CG burns himself out. Oh, double KO! Anti-air! Luke's crouching heavy punch. 
robbing CG of that anti-air option right there. Okay, I mean, some big whiffs from Raven, but no whiff punishes from CG currently. I feel like if you're CG, you're kind of happy with that because you were kind of far behind at the beginning. Yeah, if I'm CG, I, I'm happy that happened. Oh, huge jump in by CG. Okay. Ooh, the reset. Another oh one. Oh my god. All right. Guess for game. Okay. Oh, and you guessed wrong. We do the full combo. Yep. <laughs> so, you know, the first 30 seconds of this match is pretty close, but then all of a sudden CG's kind of figured stuff out. That's kind of how Manon is. Like, once you get the read on someone, you kind of just snowball pretty hard in the round. But it can turn around really quickly once someone realizes what you're doing. I would really want to see a lot more holding up from Raven, because CG's been doing a few fake command throw setups. Like the crouching medium punch, drop your combo purposely. Yeah. I mean, but you, but you know, has been doing really well. He's been the total control of this game. Yeah, Ravens just played super well this side. He's a good player. Ooh. Kind of sneaks in the command grab, gets a level up for the medals at the very least. I love this like stand medium punch into overhead and just try and like shimmy you around. I really want to see him do the overhead into command throw. It seems like people have been respecting him on hit, and uh, I feel like that could go pretty well. Ooh. Watch your toes. Oh, CG's kind of going crazy right now. But, yep. Okay. Throw. Very patient on his defense, but yep. ultimate gone throw. I think both these players have been playing pretty patient, but just the proximity of the where they're fighting has made it a bit more scrambly. Raven once again taking corner, playing pretty confidently right now in this game. The last set at times, like, looked pretty even and CG took it. But so far, this has been looking pretty uh, lopsided for Raven. I feel like he took that game pretty clean. I agree. There wasn't too many issues in that game, but well, let's see if CG kind of figures out how the, he figured out the first game. Exactly. I really want to see him kind of extend his pressure on these throws with, like, drive rush meaties. So this is the first advantage CG's had in a while. Yeah. Oh, oh what a jump. Oh, but I don't know about the burnout. And you also, the thing with hit grab is you don't have any real OP like that. Heavy kick media is fake. The overhead's fake. Any media you do is is like mostly pretty fake. Yeah, and this is an amazing scenario right now. You know, Raven has a bit of drive meter to work, yeah. but he's not burnout. While CG is completely burnt out. Yep, and and the burnout loops from Luke are pretty strong. You gotta be careful though. The burnout right there could end up biting Raven in the ass as the set goes on. Yeah, Raven just wants to take the pressure. Yep. But let's see if it. Oh, the overhead. He got hit in the air. Oh, yeah, oh, you know what? Okay, if I'm Raven, I think that was a super. Ah, oh, maybe, yeah. Okay, but it's kind of like you said, Raven chose to burn himself out just to extend the pressure, but yep. it didn't work out. That's the thing, is like burnout in this game is so rough. And Manana is one of those characters that if you are burned out first, she kills you. What a good throw. Doing the throw right there into Antir if they jump is such a strong thing Manana has. Oh, Raven already. Top 16 on the line. Do not try and DI me again. I remember that from the first set. Let's go to Memphis. Yeah, Burnt out. Yeah, huge scenario because of the burnout. Yep. Oh, oh my god. Going. We just jab. We don't care. He doesn't have the health to threaten DI anymore. Oh. And there's the overhead. And CG Roof sending Raven to losers. You know, if I'm Raven, I'm, I'm a bit frustrated, I guess, at myself for getting hit by all the overheads. But yeah. Is, I think a is. bit more DI could have been good, and then, like, the fact he went for a meaty after that super, I'm sure he gets something there, but Raven just started pressing. Yeah, all right. I think I might be up next, but we'll see. We'll see if Raven as we'll wants to come back up after that match, but we'll see. I think I rescued Volteon. Volteon's coming up here. So we can pass it on. It'll, he'll be here with me to commentate some Antrex's match. So I just want to say, I was over here, like waving, shouting Connor and Volteon. Were you really? You were standing right in front of the projector. My bad. And you were just like, you weren't looking at me, but you were looking past me at the projector. So I was just like, sorry. And sorry. just completely ignored. I'm here now. I'm here now. So are you still in Street Fighter? No. <laughs> oh, okay, okay. I went, like, I went like four and two, I think. I think I went three and two. Yeah. I like, watched to uh, Geef. Who? I don't know. CJ? I don't know. Piccolo? Could be anybody. I only know two geeks here. Piccolo, CJ, well, I know three, and Panglox. Yeah. I'll but you would know okay, if it was Panglox, young man. Oh, okay, okay. 
So right now we're going into, I think these are top 16 qualifier matches. Uh, it's going to be Ant versus Savantrix. Have you... <laughs> so are you ready to tell us how Savantrix is dropping all of his Kimberly stuff? Is he really? Uh, I missed, he, I think uh, last time he missed the air throw in every part of his combo every single time. Oh. That and sucks. then Ant here, he was my teammate. Yeah. Jamie Player from Fort Collins. Got it. Quite nice. Okay. Like, I think he's one of the, I think he's one of the, I think he can make top eight pretty sure. Easily. This is a battle of the low tiers, it sounds like. Mm -hmm. Drive rush, full screen button. True. But that's, that's this game in a nutshell. Yeah, yeah. Should be exciting. Gonna get into it here. Mm -hmm. And Lee hasn't played this game since, like, Evo. So okay. I'm curious, like, does Lee, does Savantrix know anything about, like, anything? Jamie at oh. all? <laughs> yeah. Like, Hard I don't know that much about Jamie. Yeah, I'm not sure too many people do, I guess. But, uh, I guess we'll see. We oh. gotta find out. It's been a pretty solid set, like, thing of games so far. Uh, I saw, you know, it was pretty hype. So I'm gonna tell you something, because now you're here, so you, so you understand the trash. Yeah. So you remember last spring's tourney we went to? Like, right before Aki's MA? This yeah. is forever ago. Yeah. Uh, I was talking to Veach, and he's like, man, I'm thinking about... Is he like, I think about picking up Strive because it, it seems like pretty easy because no one seems that good, right? You know, sent beats to losers today? No. Rise. Ah. <laughs> Get wrecked. Wait, was he playing Strive? He's playing Street. Oh. And Rise damn. with Chun Lee. Show sent beats. Not even. That's Beach fine. Is off honestly, his qualifier honestly match. I think the same thing about Street Fighter players. So <laughs> it's uh, completely fair. I think that's just natural to think about everybody that plays a game that you don't. Yeah, and you're like, damn, these people. Are I, all these people, I could watch. Yeah, if I played, <laughs> if I played. If I played, it'd be free. Same. All right, here we go, though. Ant laying it on thick here in the corner, but Lee, a nice jab out of there. You know, when Lee loses a match, he's like, man, if you saw me in that Path of Exile PvP. Yeah, he was cooking, bro. <laughs> I'll, I'd cook you. Ooh. Big combo here for Ant. With the corner, oh. Lee taking his turn back though. Just holding oh. up back. Brutal. There's the wreck yeah. of pressure. Oh. Lee's There's those not Kimberly like, normals. Not, I, I, uh, I like how he just backed up for no reason. Okay. Harry into the jab. Ant gonna take round so one. So drive rush, uh, drive rush slide, not good. Not real. Well, you can, you can do it into grab. Which is nice. But um, maybe not from that range. I think you can, yeah. It, it's definitely plus, but um, just barely. I see, I see. Okay, looking okay, a little okay. bit better. Then we got the shimmy. Okay, you're into the throw here. Savantrix might not have conversion, but he's got gameplay. Very true. Oh, overhead teleport. Your character's yeah. so belligerent. Overhead teleport He's completely full fake, bro. Everything sucks. All right, here we go, though. Lee gapping right now. Gonna set up in the corner. Elbow should be in. I oh, told you, you I told you every time. He could have just he hit elbow. He hasn't hit that round. combo once. But now, JB level four with the drinks. Oh, Zalay. Very nice. So, I, so Lee, so Symmetrix has not finished that combo once the entire time I'm watching him play. That's actually insane. Every time. Like, there's literally no reason to not do the elbow there. You know, you might have to get up and tell him if he loses a game. Yeah, I might. Okay, completely fake Ooh. setup there, but it works out. Look, it's, it's okay if it's fake if they were No, I'm just it. letting you know how bad this character is. I see, I see, I see. And how much Lee is gapping. I see, I see. But you know, Ant doing a little gap himself. Gonna go for the throat ripper here. Probably gonna go for the safe jump setup. Gonna uh, find a practice. But he's in there, and he's giving the kick to the face. Gonna terrible, set up. terrible. Terrible, terrible. There we go, another drink. In the corner, almost at that. I really like this, like, kind of walk back, like, shimmy play from Ant to try and bait Ooh. level one super. Oh, play. command grab, but Ooh. he doesn't finish his food. Speaking of drops. And now, Savantrix with a critical art on his hands. If he can find a way in here, but he goes for the slide, because what else are you going to do? He could have done, like, the slide that's, like, not punishable <laughs> space. He could have done, uh, like, OD teleport. Technically, empty that slide isn't punishable when it's uh, space, but... Uh, you know, 
but something tells me you don't know that much about Kimberly. I, I, I have an idea that that slide was not in a range where you no, could space I, it, it was, at all. It was. All right, here we go. All right, Ant looking for a way in, does find it. Right we're in the corner. Jamie's putting out Ooh, the, the spacing trap. Oh, boom. Oh, trying to bait another one. Yep. Rand Looking for these buttons. Kim's got no range. Jamie doesn't either, but still. Okay. Oh, the drive rush is getting checked, and now in the corner again. And it seems like this corner pressure for Ant has been going so well. I, I don't think he really needs to back up at all once he gets in. Yeah. It seems like Symmetrix has been kind of holding to this, but Ant gets a little nervous because he thinks Super might be coming, and he just kind of pulls on the back of it. Oh, yeah. Okay, punishable, but no. Not in the range. Kimberly's button's doing Savantrix dirty once again. Oh, no conversion. Okay. Oh. All right. There we go. Catch the walk back to sweep, but. Jimmy is caught. Oh, command that. Oh. What was that? That was crazy. Wake up, command front. I know that's fake, but like, what's the logic here? Uh, you're not getting in any other way. I guess. Oh, the elbow, but nothing to combo it with. And the overhead going to catch. And I think that's going to be that's the set it, right there. I think. Yeah. There we go. There is Taking the Aunt Jamie up. playing pretty clean. There you go. How clean do you really need to play against Kimberly? I mean, if you're Jamie, you're one of the characters worse than Kim, so you got to play do better. Do you think that, actually? 100%. Damn. Not you're even probably a probably bottom one, to be honest. Uh, that is. You're gonna play against Zangief in this game, and oh, all yeah. honestly tell me, Kim, worse, worse, yeah, worse. of course. Zangief just like command throws you from insane ranges with no Oki okay afterwards. Yeah, no, it's no, fine. no buttons that you can drive rush. No throw, no, no throw loop Oki. Okay. You don't have to be good to play Zangief. No neutral skips. You don't have to be good to play Zangief. You can be good and play Zangief. Look, 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 look. But you don't have to be good to win with them. I think you're just gonna downplay every character that's not Cam. That's exactly correct. And that is why I'm you here. You just don't care. This is a PSA. That's oh, a PSA. Cam, bad. True Tech you know? is the only good one out there. Oh, Straight there's up. no other good Kims in Colorado. Uh, nope. Not a single one. Dang. I'm not one of them. I know that for sure. I mean, after that showing, is Savantrix really one of them? Can't be. I'm sorry. <laughs> it's unfortunate. It's only True Tech. Yeah. He's the only much. goat out here. Actually. And he still loses in grants to some broken character, man. What can well, I he's say? out here working hard, and you know, they're out here eating the green stuff, running at people, having a good time. Oh, yeah. Good times. I wish I was having that good of a time. <laughs> With Street? Oh, I mean, I am. I, I, I lost, but I hit my like little journey thing, Shui engine, safe jump loops. I had a great time. I did an instant overhead. Yeah. So. So, uh, so are we gonna watch characters that aren't Kimberly? And you're gonna talk about like, oh man, if Kim was here, that'd be so bad. No, that's okay. not how I roll. Okay, okay. Yeah. Only when you can see her does yeah. it does it happen. Do, do my affirmations just get solidified? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. But if Kim won, it was just him gapping. Yeah, a hundred percent. This is the not fighting a game question, mentality. Bro. Yeah, bro. I'm always gapping. I went four and two today. I was gapping every single time. Even when I lost, I was gapping. I had to play a modern loop. Yeah, you know so how much I had to gap for that? Because yep. you just press one button super, and I had no buttons to actually take my turn with that character. Get out of here, bro. I'm sorry that you just couldn't jump in. Yeah. <laughs> I wasn't. I was playing grounded, bro. What? You know, the you grounded can't jump Street Fighter. Characters, you know, gra Kimberly's will tell you they're playing grounded and then do full screen slide. And be like, oh, it's just grounded footsies, man. What do you want from me? It's either you're standing there and you're doing medium kicks till the, the, the cows come home, or you're doing slide. Because they're, what, what other tools are you going to use? What, you're going to do fucking sweep? That move, I mean, that minus is fucked. Savantrix hit a few sweeps that game. Maybe if you just read their, like, one. Pussy, you know, the, their movement, and then you could hit them with it. Okay. Or, or I don't know, maybe you could do, like, the run and then, then stop. You know what's crazy about this guy? He actually used to play Marissa, and oh, yeah. he stopped playing Marissa. Marissa's great. Because he thought that she wasn't good enough. No, I thought Marissa was great. Uh -huh. I just didn't want to play her. That's all it was. Sure, bro. I just didn't want to play her. Any I went to Manon. Manon's trash. 
I think Manon's terrible. If I see Manon it? on screen, I'm gonna talk about how bad she is. I want to say CG Roop won that, that match. Gap, straight gap the entire time. Sure. I, uh, Raven's a nice guy. He's great. He was it's commentating like with me. He's good. They hit one command grab. They are. They're gapping you win. every single. Geef is gapping everybody harder than any Bro, other character in the game. Geef is not like pot and strive where you literally can't do anything. It's Geef actually has it's a game near plan. as bad. It's almost as bad. The sure. only character that's worse is like Aki. Okay. Aki is terrible. Sure. Probably like Aki, Geef, Manon. Fair. Jamie. Oh, Savantrix again? Oh, is this, a, is this a Looters match? Oh, well, never mind. I guess I am going to talk about how bad Kimberly is. We thought it was going to be over. There you go. But here we are. Savantrix to drop another combo. He's going to watch That's the stream. Rude, I literally bro. just, like, talked on him the whole time. He's a great player. I'm, I'm and I'm, a friend. Yeah. Which makes and that's it even why I want to see him do well. Uh -huh. And I'm disappointed in him for playing more Path of Exile right, 2. Right. I hope he watches this and he's like, man, screw green. And then he's just going to go play the game and get good. True. But we know he's going to watch this, say screw green, load up the game, play it, like lose one match and go play more Path of Exile. Okay. I can see it. That's all I'm saying, man. It's all the same. When, when, I, when, I can get, when I get my computer back, and I log on and I look at Steam and it doesn't say Symmetric Path of Exile 2. You're gonna be shocked. I'll be shocked. Be shocked. <laughs> Getting a little pep talk from Beach here. Look, you didn't see how bad it was earlier. It was so bad. Like, I mean, you're about to see a fun matchup here. I'm excited to see it. I think this will be a good game. Absolutely. The Blanca. Now, we're going to talk about characters. That, I'm going to let you know, when Blanca wins, they did not gap you. They're playing Blanca. Oh, yeah. Have you seen that Super 2? You know how nice Blanca players think they are yeah, when they do no the Super doubt, 2 combos? No. I have no doubt. Right, Black Hat go. Cat versus Symmetrix. OK, here we go. All right. Blanca Ball. Black Hat in there. Ooh, you know, I respect the light Blanca Ball DI. There's a certain level of degeneracy behind that mentality. We're trying to gap. So what is the what is Ooh. the option here to punish uh, Blanca Ball? Uh, DI drive rush or oh a little anti air there. Ooh, from the back throw into the corner. Ooh, bait. Oh, but we don't punish. Oh, oh. on forge. Okay. Is, is there is there a punish here? Uh, I think you have to get like a. Can you spin kick it? Uh, yeah, with light if you're like insane. Okay. But it's like incredibly hard. I like the read, but you're that that is such a degenerate oh, option. Command we grab. did a plus back jump dive kick, button button, command grab. Yep. And Black Hat just taking it. That's Blanca, baby. Can we call him Hat Cat, Black Hat, or Cat? BHC. I think, I think BHC. Okay. Okay. Blanca in there. Oh. oh. Based perfectly for that throw. Oh, missing that normal. Savantrix is going to get in there. Okay, the tries off. to jump. No pickup. And the EX wants the ball. Oh, there we go. go. We're EX. ready. Beautiful. But you spent drive meter right there just to punish a small yeah. drop ball. Are yeah. you, you're not really getting much damage out of that. Much. Oh. oh my god. Ooh, the hop. The overhead and it does bang. super. God, destroyed. And Black Hat, the BHC just looking. In control this entire set. Yep. Vantix scratching his head. It's honestly normal. I'm sure he's thinking, how do I beat Blanca? And the answer is, you just don't beat any character in this game. So, I see. I you see. really just gotta go out there and give it your all, you know? And but then you get you a really pat on the back. Like, giving it all change. right now? <laughs> I, I, what, can you say that he isn't? Ooh, oh, you know what? I think he's yeah, giving it, it your all. words, motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, okay. oh, blocks it. Very nice. There we go. Okay. Oh, I, I want it, you know, Black Eye has been holding up a lot. I really want to see just more consistent, like, EDs and frame traps to cup catch, like, the up back. All right. Chance Gets here. Hit. Oh, the doll. Okay, gotta be careful. Oh, DI is not the oh. level one. I like the level one. You lose a spray can. 
No teleport. He's about to go for something safe, but once again, in the corner of the side switch, though, for mid screen. Oh, my oh God. tries to jump up and catch him. It's all gonna get hit. Bouncing around and. Oh my hit. God! If that combo. Okay. Nice little air to air. Chance to drive rush in. No connection. Oh, we just do it. Yeah, we just throw yeah. the DI out. This is a good situation. One more DI and you can win. Can. You just gotta bait the super one. Oh, gets it. I just wanna let you know, BHC was once again holding up back. What and are you doing? I told you! I told you! He doesn't do him! He doesn't know how to do it! I told you! Just elbow. He did that last time and what then won the doing? set. And I, and I called him a fraud. <laughs> you see why I've been trashing him this yeah, whole yeah. time? <laughs> That's fair. I've justified that, right? He played the game in months. Yeah, but he he's like me, for real, for real. <laughs> oh, command grab. Bam. We're in there. Overhead going to connect. And now in corner, the cross-up back throw. Oh, my gosh. We're laying it on thick. Black cat. Pat, okay. Pat cat. That overhead going in, but the anti-air doesn't oh, get the side swap, unfortunately. Ooh, okay, but you're yes, burnt out. It's... Oh, it's advantage so low on life here. Going to try his best, but... This is looking like it might be a done deal. Oh, oh my god. god, the belligerence to wake up, light Blanca ball throw. That, that's my wake up. That's how you know, like, there's something so belligerent about having a back jump dive kick. <laughs> Are you looking at me like I just said something? I agree. I, yeah, there, there was nothing to say after that command. No. <laughs> there were no words. All right, here we go. Sometimes you got to let the game speak for itself. Oh, absolutely. All right, in the corner. Oh, nice jump. OK. OK. Mantra's trying to poke at him. Oh, oh my god. jump. OK. Can't go into the level three here. Here we go. Right. the buff. Black Hat low on meter too. Maybe you just play safe, see no, if you spend a bar. No? Oh, yeah. Oh, big whiff, but no punish. All right, dumping over. Oh, the overhead. Oh! And now we're in there. Blanca gonna get the grab. Command throw. Oh, oh no, of course. Curry is That's it. And yeah, Black Hat and Pat gonna take it. Symmetrix out. BHC making it to top 16. Very nice. My voice is already starting to die. That's crazy. You ain't even been doing nothing. Bro, I watched Rise Beat Beach and I got really excited. Damn. Right. Gotta get hyped for my boy, you know? Mm hmm. Beach is my boy too, but he said some uncouth things. That's fair. And then he got, he ate those words, didn't he? Did. He, he did. He ate those words. Uh, well, I might, I might have to go. I'm probably playing in bracket pretty soon. Yeah. So. I think bracket is coming up. Always a pleasure, my friend. Look, man, you if, you, if you have some free time, you want to go on an adventure to get yeah. green water. Green water? For me. Water for me. Oh, get water for you. I would really appreciate it. Yeah, I'll see. That's it for top 16. We're taking a break. Oh, that's it. Break? Oh, okay, I, I'll go get, I'm going to go on a venture to get green water myself. Nice. All right. Peace out. Peace out. Tune in soon. Top 8 coming up. Yeah.